Joining Xpen couldn't be easier. You will receive a invite from your admin. Go ahead and accept the invite and sign up. Once you click this button, it will open up a new page where the invite code will automatically push across. Click join team and go ahead and add your personal details. So your first name, your last name, your mobile number. Remember, we need this sometimes so you can receive one-time passcodes uh, for your card payments. So make sure this is accurate. Add a date of birth, use a strong password, and go ahead, click next. Welcome to Xpend. In Xpend, it's super easy to manage your card. Simply select Xpend cards. You'll be able to see your spending policy. You'll also be able to see how much you have left to expend. And you've also got a whole host of card security settings that you can turn on and off. We also allow you to do this in the smartphone app. If any of them are disabled, then they will be disabled by your admin, so you won't be able to change them. Connected Cards is an industry first, where you will be able to connect any card into expend and receive real live transactions and notifications when you spend with that card as it happens. These transactions clear instantly, unlike our competitors, which take 24 to 48 hours to clear. Adding your card is super easy. All you do is hit the connect card button, click continue. Great, you're all set. You're now ready to go and make transactions with your Visa company credit card or debit card or your MasterCard company credit card or debit card. Expend card transactions and connected card transactions where you use your own card can be completed easily and simply in the Expend platform. When you make a purchase, the purchase will automatically be pre-populated in your inbox. Simply click on the transaction where you'll be able to see all the information on the transaction, including how you paid with the item. Now, simply upload your receipt. You can either drag this in or select the receipt that you want to choose. Now that that's uploaded, you can automatically extract the lines so you don't have to manually enter any information. You've got the option to add tracking groups, for example, a note or a job number. In this example, I'm gonna add a note. You've also got the option to add a split, so if you didn't want to use the extract tool, you could manually add splits for the transaction if there's varying tax types or tracking groups that you need to account for. Once that's done, you can go ahead and hit save and submit, and then that will go over to your admin to review. Adding documents to expend is simple. Go ahead and hit the add documents button in the top right hand corner. You can either upload single documents or documents in bulk. You've also got the option to email the documents in. This works well for regular payments or regular bills that you might have. We're going to upload an invoice. Simply select the invoice and then head over to the documents page. As you can see, documents load instantly. We're going to extract the line items. Our technology instantly extracts this. As you can see, the category is automatically pre-populated for you, as well as the tax types. Now, simply select the payment type that you've used. We're going to select Own Funds. Now you've got the option to select any tracking groups. Then simply hit Submit, and that will go over to an admin to review. Doing a mileage claim in Expend is very easy. Click New Expense, create a mileage claim. This will open up the mileage form. The first time you use it, you will have to enter your vehicle details. You can go ahead and work through, adding the vehicle model and vehicle variant, which are optional. Select the engine size, we need this, so if you're paying HMRC advisory fuel rates, we can pay the correct rate. 
And we've also got petrol, diesel, and all the new and obscure fuel types. Add a nickname, hit create, then select that vehicle from the drop down. As you can see, we've got a wide variety of policies. We have the motorcycle policy, the car and van policy at 45 PMR, which drops to 25 PMR after 10,000 miles, as well as HMRC advisory fuel rates. You can put in a point of interest, business name, location. Um, we're going to go from our office and we're going to go to Old Trafford. As you can see, the distance is automatically calculated for us. We can go ahead and add any custom tracking groups. You can also do a return leg within one click. Once you're done, hit save and that will calculate the mileage that's due to you. You can go ahead now and submit it and then that will go over to your admin for review. Now we've been through all the expense claim types that you can create, I will show you where you can find them in the inbox. The inbox is your central hub where you can find all your expense claims, whether they are new transactions that need to have details completed in the form to send to your boss for review or whether they've been submitted expenses you've already done. You can see what their status is, whether they've been approved, rejected or if your manager has requested more information. Think of the inbox as a task list where you can see all outstanding tasks and progress on existing tasks or in this case expense claims. Happy expending!